Hello mga engineers. Our topic for today's video is all about orthogonal trajectories and application of first order differential equation. So bali dito, magre-recall tayo ni differential calculus, yung mga basic differentiation to be specific sa implicit differentiation kasi magde-derive tayo ni x and y. Okay? So ito yung main concept ng orthogonal trajectories dy over dx is equal to the negative reciprocal of the slope of the family of curves. So, dito guys, gumawa ako ng process step by step kung paano isolve ito, itong problem na to. So, step 1 is rearrange. Um, rearrange natin yung equation such that masiparate natin ang mga variables like x and y sa mga arbitrary constant. And then, step 2, derive natin using basic differentiation. Step 3, Slope. So, dito na yung papasok ang perpendicular na concept ng slope. And then, step 4, integrate natin. And then, step 5, rearrange ulit. Okay? Start na tayo sa problem. So, our first problem, find the orthogonal trajectories of family of circles x squared plus y squared plus c squared. So, lalagay muna natin yung equation. x squared plus y squared equals c squared. So, yung step 1 natin is rearrange. Uh, sa particular problem na to, separated na yung variables sa mga arbitrary constant. So, proceed na tayo kay step 2, yung derive. So, derive natin to using implicit differentiation. So, derive natin tong tatlong to. So, derivative ng x squared is 2x. Derivative ng y squared is 2y y prime. Derivative ng constant? 0. So, ilipat natin sa kabila si 2x. So, matitira dito ay si 2y. y prime equals negative 2x. So, divide natin by 2y para matitira natin is si y prime. So, divide both sides by 2y. So, y prime is equal to um, negative x over y. So, ito yung slope ni family of circles natin. So, step 3 na tayo. Uh, yung slope. So, dito na papasok yung concept ni orthogonal trajectories. So, yung slope, uh, dapat perpendicular yung slope ni trajectories sa slope ni uh, family of circles natin. So, step 3 is dy over dx equals negative 1 over uh, lalagay natin to sa baba kasi ito yung slope ng family of circles natin. So, negative x over y. So, magiging y over x. Tapos, so, ganito mangyayari. Um, dy over y equals dx over x. Tapos, papasok na tayo sa step 4. Integrate. So, integrate natin to. Um, Integral of dy over y is simply ln y equals integral of uh, dx over x is simply ln x. Pero dito, may plus c na tayo. So, hindi pa to yung final answer natin. Dapat mawala si ln dito. So, alam naman natin na to eliminate ln, lalagyan, mo, lalagyan natin ng e sa baba. Okay? So, e plus e. So, cancel to. Mawala na to. So, mag magiging y equals x e to the power of c is simply c or y equals cx. So, ito yung sagot sa problem 1 natin. So, proceed na tayo sa next problem. So, our second problem, find the orthogonal trajectories of the family of curves y equals a x to the power 5. So, sundan lang natin yung process sa pag-solve nito para di tayo mawala. So, sulat muna natin yung equation. Um, y equals a x to the power 5. So, yun nga, uh, rearrange muna natin. a equals y 
over x to the power 5. And then, derive natin. So, yung gagamitin natin, is so pag-derive nito, is d, du, minus u, d, v, over v squared. So, ito yung gagamitin natin, galing, galing sa differential calculus na rule. So, a equals, yung v natin dito, si x to the power 5. So, x to the power 5 squared. And then, x to the power 5, derivative ng u. So, yung u natin si y. So, y prime minus um, y. Tapos, derive natin sa x to the power of 5. So, magiging 5x to the power of 4. So, yung derivative ng constant, simply 0. So, uh, manipulate natin yung equation. So, x to the power of 5 squared times 0 equals x to the power of 5y prime minus 5x to the power of 4y. So, x to the power of 5 uh, squared times 0, simply 0. So, matitira dito is x to the power of 5 y prime equal uh, minus 5 x to the power of 4 y equals to 0. So, ilipat natin si 5 x to the power of 4 y sa right side. Yung matitira dito is si x to the power of 5 y prime equals 5 x to the power of 4 y. So, divide both sides by x to the power of 5. So, y prime equals 5y over x. So, ito yung slope natin. So, step 3. dy over dx equals negative 1 over 5y over x. So, ang mangyayari dito is dy over dx equals um, negative x over 5y. So, dy times 5y equals negative x dx. So, 5y dy equals negative x dx. So, step 4 na tayo. Integrate natin both sides. So, magiging 5y squared over 2 equals negative x squared over 2 plus plus c tayo dito. So, multiply natin ng 2. Magiging 5y squared equals negative x squared plus 2c or simply c. And then, the final answer natin, 5y squared plus x squared equals C. So, ito yung final answer natin. So, proceed tayo sa ating last problem. Our last problem, find the orthogonal trajectories of the parabolas with vertices at the origin and the foci on the x-axis. So, yung sinasabi sa given is vertices at 0, 0. So, balian dito. Tapos, at the origin, and the foci on the x-axis. So, ibig sabihin, yung opening ng parabola is pag ganito. Pag ganyan. So, yung vertex niya is at 0, 0. So, yung equation niya, simply, x squared equals plus minus 4 ay. Pag hindi naman at the origin, Pag ganito, yung vertex niya, so yung gagamitin natin, x minus h squared equals plus minus 4a y minus k. So ito yung gagamitin natin pag hindi origin or 0, 0 yung vertex niya. So sa problem natin at the origin, so ito yung gagamitin natin. So start na tayo. Erase yung natin. So, x squared equals plus minus 4ay. 
Okay. So, yung first step natin is, yun nga, rearrange natin. So, x squared over y equals plus minus 4a. So, step 2, derive natin. So, yung gagamitin natin is VDU. VDU minus UDV over V squared. So, galing sa differential calculus na rule. And then, yung V squared natin dito si Y. So, magiging uh, 4A equals Y squared tapos V Y tapos DU natin, derive natin si X squared. Magiging 2X minus yung U natin, si X squared. And then, i-derive naman natin si Y. So, magiging Y prime. So, derivative ng constant, simply, 0. So, manipulate lang natin yung equation. So, magiging Y squared times 0 equals 2XY minus X squared Y prime. So, 0 na to. So, X squared Y prime equals 2XY. So, divide both sides by x squared. So, yung matitira is cy prime equals 2y over x. So, ito yung slope natin. And then, step 3 na tayo. Um, dy over dx equals negative 1 over 2y over x. So, magiging dy over dx equals negative x over 2y. So, 2y dy equals negative x dx. So, dito, step 4 na tayo. Integrate natin. Integrate. Integrate. So, magiging y squared equals negative x squared over 2 plus c. So, times natin ng uh, 2, so magiging 2y, 2y squared equals negative x squared plus 2c, or simply c. So, yung final answer natin is 2y squared plus x squared equals 2c. So, ito yung final answer natin, guys, sa ating last problem. So, so, yun lang mga engineers Sundan nyo lang yung process para di kayo malito. Okay? So, good luck and God bless. Thank you.